New to Levin Central Georgia Technical College held an active shooter simulation earlier today. It's designed to help the nursing students respond to real life's casualties. Reporter Camila Williams went there to show you how it all worked. You never know when it could happen. But students from CGTC have partnered with the Trinity School of Medicine to create a joint field training exercise. The exercise, an active shooter incident. Unfortunately, mass casualty events are becoming more and more common. They used helicopters, smoke bombs and makeup enhancements to make the scenario feel more realistic. And it's good to know that your students are being prepared in a simulated environment to respond to that situation if by chance it were to occur. Dean of Health Sciences Alvin Harmon said the drill is meant to apply their medical skills from the classroom and test them in a real world situation. Warner Robbins and Houston County Fire Department, along with other public safety and medical personnel, went to help out. Registered nursing student Leah Crosley said this simulation would help her have a better relationship with the health care units. Um, I think it's important that we learn how to work with surge techs, with other nurses, with the doctors, and even with our community. According to the Center for Homeland Defense and Security, the U.S. saw 249 school shootings in total in 2021. That's the most ever in a year so far. The next highest number of incidents happened in 2019 with 119. We're trying to not only meet the workforce needs today, we're trying to exceed and excel at meeting those workforce needs. Harmon says the drill is how CGTC enhances the students' learning environment. In Warner Robins, Camila Williams. 13 WMAZ News. CDC data shows gun violence killed an average of nine children per day in 2019. That year, firearms were the leading cause of death in children and teens.